Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Thank you all for clicking on this video. If you like talking about movies way too much, then you are in the right place. And how about clicking that subscribe button? So today we're going to be talking about Becky. When she was a little girl. Becky! When she was good. Stop running! She was very, very good. And when she was bad, hey! she was horrible. So Becky is rated R. It is considered a thriller mystery. It's an hour and 40 minutes long. It was available to rent, um, on june the 5th now this one i believe only cost me about eight dollars to rent uh compared to the twenty dollars that you normally get with the um newer movies that come out stars joe McHale, lulu wilson and kevin james you guys i believe this is kevin james first official bad guy role and he literally like took it there you guys like sure you're gonna hear this a lot throughout a bunch of reviews he seemed to have took pointers from adam sandler with you know his uncut gems last year mind you adam sandler has been kind of like sneaking his way into uh dramatic more serious roles throughout the years but kevin james just kind of just dropped this on us not only is he a bad guy you guys all right not only is this a serious role but he's a freaking nazi a nazi child killer that's right the king of queens is a freaking nazi child killer now this is another movie that i actually didn't really know too much about i just saw somebody review it and i was like oh that seems kind of interesting kevin james is in it and i'm a big fan of his and i was very eager to see him in a more serious role this is not at all what i expected to be honest. well mind you i didn't expect anything because i didn't know anything about it but this is not what I expected that I was going to be getting into with the Kevin James uh, movie. Lulu is the one that plays Becky and she is a 13 year old teenage girl who just pretty much hates the world. Um, seeing that her mom just recently passed away from cancer. The dad's in a whole new relationship within the year of the mom dying from cancer. Like who moves on that fast? I, I don't Mind you, he does say in the movie, your mother was the love of my life. But yet you seem to have moved on very quickly from the love of your life. I don't know, I guess love is love, right? So whenever it hits, it hits. I was judging too quickly, you guys. Please don't come after me for that. But still, I I get where uh, Becky's anger kind of came from. This is going to be a spoiler review, you guys, because so much happens. Like craziness happens that I cannot not talk about it, you guys. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and just start really quickly with something that does happen in the beginning of the movie. Really think it's important to kind of pre-warn you of how this movie starts because of what's currently going on in society right now with Black Lives Matter. You start off the movie um, in a prison and there is a fight going on between the Nazis and um, some black prisoners. Now somewhere within the fighting, they do end up killing one of the black prisoners while they're out in the yard. So I'm actually kind of shocked that they did end up keeping that part of the scene in the movie like i think it uh they could have definitely taken that out and just have left it as the fighting but they did decide to keep it on um again the movie came out on june the 5th so was that around the time that everything kind of started happening or was that before oh i can't even remember but you know i just saw the movie so i'm not exactly sure but i'm surprised that even though if it did happen after the fact that i'm surprised it didn't pull it edit it that portion out and then like basically like re-release it now kevin james and like his little nazi group posse whatever end up escaping a uh, prison i believe it's like five of them in total and they end up going to this lake house to go find this key this lake house so happens to belong to uh becky's uh family and they so happen to decide to go to this lake house during this particular weekend i mean bad timing right I honestly thought I was going to dislike Becky because she is so disrespectful to her father like oh no 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 I do not play like that like that little girl should have got slapped so long ago like I get that like, your mom died okay but there's no reason for you to be disrespecting your parent you know in the midst of her being out in her little fort the bad guys come and all hell breaks loose you guys there's two dogs you guys and I make a point I think y'all know where I'm going with this with the dogs because the damn guy ends up killing one of her dogs. Her precious little dogs shoots the poor dog like multiple times at you bastard. 
injured. I mean, to say he is the first to go and wow, the way that he dies is crazy. She like stabs him with some pencils and like puts like a ruler through his neck and like keeps stabbing him with some pencils. Oh, you guys. So if you are not somebody who likes like gruesome things, this movie is not for you, you guys. Like, I'm gonna just tell you that right now because there is a lot of blood. Um, unless you're kind of psychotic like me and my little sister because we were watching it and we're just like, oh my God, <gasps> dude. I mean, it was just, it was it was a lot, you guys. When she ends up like stabbing um, Kevin James in the, in the eye with the key and like the eyeball is like popping out, you guys. Oh, the dad. And it didn't help you guys that Kevin ended up killing her father basically in front of her eyes. So that's kind of where she really lost it. Your Mallet, I think that's how you say his last name. He plays Apex. He's the big, tall, like beefy guy. I think he used to be like in wrestling. Kills him too. I mean, mind you, the way that he's probably the one that had it not as bad literally just a gunshot to the head but that was towards the end while he's literally apologizing and absolutely no remorse she enjoyed killing this no lies you guys i would love love to see a sequel to this movie like what became of you like how crazy did you get like sort of like assassin did you join the military like what became of you are you just like a normal like college student and I, I don't know you guys I want to know what happens to this girl but like when she gets older I freaking love this movie you guys I'm giving it a large popcorn rating I know a lot of you are gonna be like really Stephanie seriously and this is I don't care I freaking loved Becky it was awesome one of my favorite movies of the year you guys it's just so my cup of tea I just so much violence so much murder so much guts and eyeballs popping out oh my god not for the faint of heart you guys seriously but if you do not mind none of that then i feel like you're truly going to enjoy this movie is it the best movie technically speaking no it's not but it's highly highly entertaining kevin james you guys did great as this nazi murderous ex-con well technically he's they're still cons you guys because they escape prison he does great as being the leader i'm gonna lie you guys i love that it's a psychotic little girl because girl power and, and that they didn't make this character into a psychotic boy with that said if you've seen becky let me know down below what you guys thought about it you like it you love it you hate it was it just not for you i totally totally understand if this movie is not for you but it's very very gruesome you guys there is a lot a lot a lot of murder a lot of gruesome bloody murder which is awesome for crazy people like me but you may be sane so you may not enjoy this which is okay it's okay of course before you guys click out of this video don't forget to give it a like and if you are a crazy person like i am who loves these gruesome movies bloodiness all over you know what you and i are going to get along so how about subscribing to my channel and of course don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time i post something new until next time i'll see you guys at concession Bye.